Hi guys, welcome back. My name is Kenzie if you're new here. For today's video, I want to do a Christmas haul. So I'm going to show you everything that I've just curated for this year's 2023 Christmas season. And I know that it's early, but honestly, this is the time where everybody's doing their shopping. So a lot of these items are either already sold out or will sell out within the next coming weeks. So I wanted to just get on here, tell you what I'm liking this year, show you everything that I got, hopefully give you guys some Christmas inspiration. I am so excited. Honestly, I think it's never too early to decorate for Christmas. I am just so eager to decorate. We are definitely getting in the Christmas spirit over here. So let me just show you the goodies that I found. All of these products will be tagged in the tagged products at the top of the description box, or you can click on it, I think right when this video pops up. There should be a little button to click on all of these things and then you can just shop through there you can also see the pictures and the prices and everything so it's a lot easier for you to shop i also get a very small commission if you shop through those links too so i appreciate that so so much you guys you don't know how much that really it means to me when people shop through my links it just means the world to me and it really it makes a difference for me and my family so i just appreciate you guys so so much but yeah everything of course will be linked and tagged in this video most of the items i'm sharing with you today are from target but there are a few from other places as well i really wanted to get my hands on all of the target things that i wanted because target just sent, tends to sell out so quickly i remember last year they released a few things and then they never put them back in stock so right when they released this year i knew i had to get my hands on some things that i really wanted before they sold out i think some of these things are sold out some of these things are not quite yet but if they are sold out you can always just go online to the link of the product and click the toggle the little notify me when it's back thing and it, they'll send you an email or notification right when it comes back so you can just click on it and buy it right then okay so the first items that i got are these knit stockings so this is a brown color oh i should show you that it has a little tassel thing this is in the color brown they also came out with a cream color i didn't like how the cream has this where it wraps around this little tassel is a green string and then the one on the cream is a red string and i just was not feeling the red string but you can barely see the green the green string like i didn't even know i had it honestly until it came and i love it i love chunky knit cozy things for all the time of year but especially for christmas we have other knit stockings as well so i just got two of these and i was going to mix it in with my other cream knit stockings that we already have maybe me and nick can have these darker ones and the kids can have the lighter ones or vice versa I don't know but this is totally a vibe so comfy so neutral so cozy i like how it's a dark brown it's not something that you see in stockings a lot or just like during the, in the christmas time you don't really see this color but i honestly think it's so cozy and it's a nice neutral but it still is dark so it can add that contrast as well love this guy and he is only 14.99 which i think is such a good deal especially compared to other high-end ones that i've seen online they can go for like 30 to 40 dollars and look very similar to this very good quality too it has like a lining on the inside and it's very thick and chunky and just beautiful this is by hearth and hand i got this at target and highly recommend love these i hope they're still in stock online if not check your stores i think i will just do all of my target ones because i don't know makes no sense so this is the next thing that I got, this scalloped brass Christmas card holder, and this is just beautiful. This is also by the Hearth and Hand line. Oh, how much was this? I don't know. I ripped the tag off. Um, I'm not sure, but it will be on the side here so you guys can check. This is beautiful. I absolutely love the scallop detail. You guys know how much I've been into scalloped things this year, and this is just perfect honestly i'm probably going to use this year round i'm planning on either putting this on my mantle or on my floating shelves in my kitchen um so this is meant to be used as like a card holder i got some of our old christmas cards to like show you an example um but i was thinking that would be really pretty if you put some stems in here and kind of made a little arrangement kind of like a dough bowl but not so there's like a little line here and I think it would just be perfect to just stick some stems in and then this with like just like some Christmas stems 
maybe some lights on your mantle. Oh my gosh, how pretty. I'm gonna definitely experiment with different things this year because I have a lot of just random fun ideas and that is one of them. I haven't seen a lot of people talk about this and I don't know why. I think it is stunning. Next item I got also from Target, but this is from the Target dollar spot. I just thought this was cute. Um, it's a little snowflake jar, so his head pops off. And I just thought he would be cute for my kitchen. I have been really into decorating with glass or acrylic or just using that in my design spaces. You guys will see that very soon in my kitchen reveal. I have been very into just having like clear accents. So your architecture and the design and the style of your home can stand out more, if that makes more sense, rather than the decor pieces. So, uh, this would be really cute. He has a little smiley face and a scarf um, on his front, but I might just turn him around and just use him like this. I think he'd be really cute just like this with nothing inside, but you could also, of course, put like candy or like candy canes or something cute inside there as well. They also had a tree that looked exactly like this, was about the same size, but it was just a tree. I feel like I have a lot of trees and I don't have a lot of snowmen, so I thought he was cute. The next item I got is this beautiful, beautiful wreath. Okay, it's a little loud. So it has, okay, come on. So it has these bells on it. I want to say that this is cedar. It looks like cedar to me. Um, and that is the style of branch, branch, leaf, stem that I'm going for this year for Christmas. I just love how wispy and almost whimsical it looks. Sorry, these are just really banging. Um, so this is stunning. I love how it's like a half wreath or a hoop wreath. I don't know what the correct term for that is, but how pretty is this? It's just a little bit more unique and I'm just loving that style. It's a little bit more simple too. It doesn't take up too much room and I am just loving this. I immediately when I saw this, I put it in my cart. I got this in store and I was just blown away by the quality, but she is just stunning. Comes with two little bells and then a velvet black ribbon. And I am just in love with this. I'm not sure how much this was, but I wanna say it was like 40 or 50. Um, definitely very reasonable compared to like high-end stores or just other stores that I've seen. But this is just so beautiful for either a front door or maybe a range hood. I cannot wait to decorate. Next, I got these little houses and they have a few different options of these. So I got this little church guy and then I just got another one of these. These do light up. Let's see, does it work? Yes, it works. So these light up, so cute. They look very handmade in ceramic. These are only five, this is my hair. These are only five dollars, you guys. I think that is a very good deal. This looks like it should be more, to be honest. They have almost like a speckled, ceramic pottery look and it's just beautiful i have some other houses that i have already from previous years that are going to go great with this and i don't have any churches so i was really excited to find that a church was released too this is by the brand wonder shop i believe from target and this was also five dollars as well so they have a whole bunch of different options of like these houses. I know they had a few others as well. And I just think that is such a good deal. I know that, I think it was Studio McGee released some houses that were like $40 or something for three of them, which they look very similar to these. So I feel like compared, that's pretty steep, but these are just gorgeous, neutral, and they come pre-lit too, so. They're great. Next, I have this wax tree. This isn't a candle that you light. It's an LED light, so it does light up, but I just think this is beautiful. I have been on the hunt for one of these this year. I knew that I wanted to have one in my decor, but the ones online that I've seen are like 40 to $50, like insane for just a little Christmas tree candle like this. So this was $10 at Target. I thought it was a great deal. You just put two, I think, AA batteries into this. I can't see. Yeah, you put two AA batteries into this and then it lights up. You can set it on a timer. Such a great deal. Um, so cute too. They had a green one as well that was like a little frosted effect, but since I am a neutral gal, I'm going a lot more neutral and just styling recently. So I went for the white and I think it is gorgeous. I wanna try to find a pine cone or something to set next to it. So it can be this and a pine cone, like a wax pine cone. That would be really pretty. So on the hunt for that. Last time I couldn't find a link for this guy, which I was so sad. So I'm gonna try my best to link him, but 
I'm sorry if I can't. Sometimes Target's website is just, I don't know about you, but to me, it's like the worst thing to navigate. <laughs> um, you can't find the things that you want. Like if you look up wax trade, that this is not, is what, this won't come up. It's gonna be something totally different. Anyways, I will try my best to find this for you. I will search the entire website and try to find this. But if not, definitely go check out your stores. I had so many in stock in my store. So next I got this little bell. This is by Studio McGee, I believe. Again, tore the price tag off, look at me. So I got this little bell. I love decorating with bells and I just love the little leaf garland almost detail. It's definitely more gold rather than brass. It would be a cute just piece to a style on top of some books or just a filler piece for your shelves or um, even like a tablescape, a few of these for your tablescape. So many different ways that you can use a decor piece like this. Bells have been very popular over the past few Christmas seasons and they're just a classic statement piece. I don't think they're ever gonna go anywhere. I know that this is one of the things that sold out very quickly last year and they didn't restock it again. So hopefully that is not the case this year, but I will leave a link for you no matter what. So next I got this Christmas tree rolling pin and it just has Christmas trees engraved into it. This is so cute. I'm planning on putting this in my kitchen crock and I am indecided about the color of the wood. I kind of wish that it was a little bit cooler toned, but I do like the warm tones for Christmas and just being cozy and it's a nice just different accent. I have a lot of lighter and more natural wood colors in my home. so. This darker wood will be a nice accent. And this was only $12.99. This is from the Hearth and Hand section from Target. And I just think it is a great find. It's definitely gonna add that little pop of Christmas to my kitchen and I am so excited for that. The next item I picked up is this beautiful candelabra from Hearth and Hand again. Hearth and Hand is just, we're going hand in hand this year. They have these fluted, almost like flowery like candlesticks on them and it is just so beautiful. I am thinking about a few different ways to style this. I'm, I have so many different ways. You can put this on a mantle. Let me just tell you. You can put this on a mantle. Um, I also stuck this on my windowsill and it fit perfectly on there and so I think that's where I might put it this year, just on my windowsill, and then have candles sticking out, and then we can light them every evening. This would be great for tablescapes or for a mantle. So many different options. And again, this is also a piece that you can use year round. And this is just not something that I have. And I feel like this is gonna be a good, just year round staple piece, or if I'm ever hosting. I love the brassiness, how it's not too gold, but it's a very nice antique gold. Perfect, love her. This was $39.99. Hopefully it is in stock when I am posting this video. I know that it has come in and out of stock. So if it's not in stock right now, definitely turn on your notifications because it probably will come back in. But for $40, I mean, you can't go wrong. This is just beautiful. So excited to use this. Okay, now let's do an unboxing together. I ordered these online and I haven't even unbox them yet. So first impressions together. Guess what this is from, Cards in Hand. Oh, I like these. Oh, okay, that's interesting. Okay, B, this, it's hollow on the side, so I thought it was all gonna be glass, but is it glass? Yeah, it's glass. Okay, so these are little brass and clear houses. They came in a set of three. So there's three different sizes, but they don't have glass. They only have glass on the back and the front, not on the side. So that's kind of interesting. Um, but I think that these are so pretty. Like I said, I've just been so into using clear things recently so I can show off more of the other elements in my home. But these are gorgeous. I am so excited to use these. I'm planning on using these in my kitchen on my floating shelves up against my backsplash. So the backsplash will kind of pop through them and really show and then you can show off the backsplash and show off some Christmas as well without it being too loud and busy. Very unique too. It's not like your typical ceramic houses, but love these. Definitely a more minimal style if you're into that. Mm, these are, and these were $29.99 for a pack of three, which 
Seeing these in person that might be a little steep, I was anticipating them to be just a tad bit bigger, but I probably would have got, got these regardless, honestly, because I love them. I just <clears throat> love the style of them, and it's just my vibe. My vibe this year. Another thing I got for my floating shelves, I'm undecided on this. We're going to test it out together, see if it looks good or if it looks like I'm five years old. We're going to see <laughs> together. So it is these iridescent Christmas trees. These are so beautiful. These just bring out my inner mermaid. And I got these from the dollar section at Target. These are also glass and they're pretty heavy. They're very nice quality. So the smaller one was $3 and this one was five. My backsplash is very, it just has so many different colors. It has hues of purple and blue and yellow and green and everything that this these trees are giving off. And I just think that they're going to go really, really well together. Either that or it's just not going to look good and it's going to look very out of place. So I'm like picturing these up against the backsplash kind of blending in a little bit, but also up there because all of our windows face that direction. And so I think having like the sun shine off of these would be a nice sparkly, pretty Christmas moment. I don't know. Oh, they also turn on. I didn't even know that. Look at that. I got these from the Target dollar spot. I don't know. These might be a return. I don't know. We're going to see together. Is it a vibe? Is it not? We're going to find out. This is, I think, one of my favorite things that I picked up this year, and it is because it's pretty, it's practical. It's everything that I love. So it is this Christmas candle. This is the Fireside Glow candle. It's 25 ounces. It was $25 as well. And is it gold? Is it silver? I don't know. It's a little mix of both and it is just beautiful. It has like a speckled, almost like just not distressed, but um, just like a like sparkly, holy almost feel. From some angles, it looks gold. From some angles, it looks silver and it is just so beautiful. And let me tell you, I've clearly I've lit it already. It is the perfect Christmas smell. If, if you want your home to smell like Christmas, but you don't necessarily want it to smell like a forest, like a pine tree forest a pine tree this is such a great scent it has a subtle hints of christmas and spice and also like a cashmere almost moody scent it has like very very subtle hints of like your like christmas trees but it's not like a christmas tree scent um i know that there's some people who like just do not like the christmas tree scent and i feel like if you're one of those people you'll really like this scent because it is just so perfect it is oh I need to go back and get more. I should have got two. I also picked up this little candle. This is from Hearth and Hand. I have no idea what this scent is because it's not saying on the bottom, but I want to say it's the berry one. That's what it smells like <laughs> to me. Um, but it's in this nice kind of clear, almost like half clear, half white, almost like a frosted, fluted jar. Very pretty and it was only $6.99. I just got this for my bathroom or for my room or something. Um, just another little Christmas candle. Love her. Very good, very subtle, a little bit more fruity and less moody than the other one, but still very good. Just a different vibe. That is it for Target. Holy cow. Now let's go to Walmart. <laughs> so um, from Walmart, I got this ornament and this is wood and then it has this leather like strap on the top and on the bottom. So I just love this. I think it's very unique. I got a few of these. These were $4.98 each for each ornament. So um, I mean, not the cheapest, especially for Walmart, but it is very heavy. It feels very high quality and I, I like it. It's I like how it's light wood, kind of very beachy and the wood and the, with the leather accents are gonna match a lot of the things in my home. Not wait to put it on my tree this year. And then I also got these ornaments. So um, this ornament used to look like these um, and they have snowflakes on them and some pine cones and some really like fake faux looking pine greenery on them. And I have been on the hunt for like Sherpa or boucle ornaments of some sort. Nick was actually in Walmart the other day and he saw these. He knows that I am on the hunt. He knows what I like. So he called me, he FaceTimed me and he said they have these Sherpa ones, but they have this snowflake on them and some other stuff and I said well get them anyways and we'll experiment maybe we can just like tear them off and make our own and that is what we did they were just hot glued on there very easy to tear off and I did like 
tear off a little bit of the Sherpa right here. That's because I used scissors and I cut a little bit too much off. That was my fault. Um, but overall, it looks so good. I cannot wait to do that to every single one. It does come with this little string, um, but I think I'm just going to replace it with like a velvet ribbon or a velvet... I don't know, different string, a, a better string. It's just a very simple, easy DIY that you can do to get a nice, neutral, cozy look. Or you can just leave it like that, if that's how you like it. But $7.98 for a pack of four, I think is a really good deal, and these have a lot of potential. The next things I got are from Amazon, and I wouldn't say that this is necessarily a Christmas item, but this was just released, and it does, it has Christmas vibes in it. So um, I'm gonna be using it for Christmas decorating. So I wanted to show this to you. This is Call It Home by Amber Lewis. And she just released this book of hers and it is just stunning. Like the, the stuff inside of this book is so pretty. This color is just so perfect for Christmas. It looks a lot redder online, but it's more brown in person. It's also showing up kind of red on camera. It's more brown in person. It's like a reddish brown, perfect for the fall and the Christmas time. So I'm planning on just using these on my floating shelves, either in my kitchen or in my living room, but just a nice neutral book. I also, oh, this is also not Christmas at all, but I also picked up The Art of Home by Shane McGee. This is also a, a new release and such, uh, these are one of my two favorite interior designers and they both released brand new coffee table books like within the same week or two of each other and I was just, had to get my hands on both of them. They are both just stunning. So I think these two together is such a vibe, especially for Christmas. Um, we have our neutrals, we have our pop of brown and slash red and it's just gonna be perfect for the fall and Christmas time. And honestly, you can never have too many coffee table books. I love a good coffee table book. They're pretty and they're practical. You know, y'all know me. And the last time I got is this pack of velvet ribbon. So I got this from Amazon. I hope it's still in stock by the time I'm posting this video. Um, but it is just this beautiful brown neutral color so so soft um i'm gonna use this in so many different places in my home i know i'll probably put these around my stockings i might put some velvet around my tree i'll probably tie it around some garland on my banister on my stairs but the velvet material for christmas has just been very popular and it's just a nice cozy but also elegant aesthetic and i'm here for it and i remember these sold out on amazon like by november last year so if you want some ribbon or vel anything velvety definitely go check amazon i do know hobby lobby also has some velvet ribbon oh wait that is not all i also got this pillow <laughs> this is from target again from the hearth and hand section i want to say this was like 16 dollars or like 17 dollars, something really random um but i love this it has an embroidered there's dog hair all over it it's fine it has an embroidered Christmas tree on it in green and then it has like a just nice little like dotted embroidered line around the edge and it's just a nice cute little simple pillow. It is like pretty small. You want to use it as an accent piece of course but I just think it is so so cute, so precious and just a nice neutral classic traditional Christmas piece love this pillow and that is everything that i got so if you are still watching and still here thank you so much for sticking around i appreciate you all of these links will be tagged in the tag products of this video and if you're new here i would love to have you stick around and subscribe leave a comment down below have you guys started christmas shopping yet have you started decorating for christmas when do you guys normally decorate is it beginning of november is it after thanksgiving is it right now let me know. I am very curious. Please give this video a thumbs up too. It really helps out my channel. I will see you guys in a few days in a new video. Bye.